our beautiful fight. Welcome to STEM in Education, Sea, Air, and Space, Principles of Engineering. I'm Mr. Johnson. Today we will be exploring aerodynamics using Bernoulli's principles. Bernoulli principles focus on the flow of dynamic fluids. The dynamic fluid we will be exploring today will be air, this fiscal wind tunnel. We're going to experiment with two gliders. This glider here is B1, this glider here is B2. These gliders are paper engineered. Let's start testing with G1 first. Let's place G1 into the wind tunnel. Bernoulli principle states, with an increase of aerospeed, creates a decrease in static pressure. We're going to increase the airspeed, and let's observe the airfoils or the wings on this paper glide. One, two knots, three, everything is stabled. 3.5 stapled 4 5 5 Okay, there it is. Aerodynamics of this aircraft, the airspeed at 5.5, seems to have a stabilization with this glide. At this time, it's time to test G2, glider 2. Here's the airspeed control. Observe the wings. There it is, that's the bending point. So let's increase the airspeed and see where the stability speed of this glider. Oh, it's much less. This is one, two, this is three. 3.2 knots versus G1. G1 can tolerate a little bit more airspeed than G2. The difference between glider 1 and glider 2, beautiful aerofoil is left. Glider 1 aerofoil is 14.5 centimeters. Glider 2 aerofoil is It's 15 centimeters. Let's test and see how they fly naturally in room temperature air. Here's glider 1, first test flight. T minus 5. Four, three, two, glider one. Glider one, second test flight. T minus five, four, three, two, one, glider one. <laughs> glider one is flying well. Glider one, third test flight.
T minus five, four, three, two, one. Light on one. Light on one, even want to play the guitar. Here's player two, first test flight. T minus five, four, three, two, one. Lighter two. Lighter two, second test flight. T minus five, four, three, two, one. Lighter two. Lighter two, third and final test flight. T minus five, four, three, two, one. Now let's discuss lighter one. Lighter two. Lighter one airfoil length is 14.5 centimeters. Lighter two airfoil length is 15 centimeters. Lighter one wind tunnel experiment went up to 5.5 knots and G2, I believe, went up to 3.2 knots. G1 was able to withstand higher airspeed than G2. A wind tunnel helped us understand aerodynamics and Bernoulli's principles of flight. There's four forces acting on these objects. Lift, gravity or weight, thrust or drag. Lift is an upward force. Weight or gravity is a gravitational force. Thrust is a moving force through the air and drag is the resistance of the thrust. Newton's third law in physics states, for every action, there's an equal opposing reaction. We have thrust, the opposing force is drag. We have lift, the opposing force is gravity. Thank you for joining us. STEM and education, sea, air, and space, principles of engineering, I'm Mr. Johnson, see you next time.